Alan Cox asks, what happened that took freedom to such another level from previous work? That record was a quantum leap and remains a favorite of all Christian CDs. Was Brown Bannister influential? Oh, good gosh, yes. You know, um, I very humbly say I have been so blessed to be in Whiteheart with a, a, a rotisserie of great players. We have had great player after great player after great player after great writers, you know, good singers, but very, very, very talented people in this band. And I consider myself extremely blessed to have been a part of this ex Whiteheart experience. And that Freedom Band was certainly a collection of not only great creative talents, but of characters. Man, there are some, we were nutty people. It was, it was fun. And, but, but, uh, you know, and I'll say this, when you're around a lot of really talented people, and this, this is definitely true in the case of the Freedom Band, but I think it's true in other genres. If you're in a, in a kitchen with a bunch of great cooks, they're going to have a lot of great ideas about how to bring something. And if you're in a, you're in a tech meeting, an IT th uh, situation, you're trying to bring your product to the market, and you've got really talented people, they're going to come up with a lot of ideas. Well, when we were in the Freedom era of the band, there were a lot of people with a lot of great ideas, and there are a lot of shades of right. I mean, you can, you, there are a lot of right ways to make a great song when you've got that kind of talent in the room. Enter Brown Bannister, because Brown is this gentle-hearted, listening kind of guy who made everybody feel in the room like their idea meant something, and it was worthwhile to listen to, and he would say, mm hmm now we try this, we try that, you know, I'm thinking maybe we need to go over there. Only that gentle spirit and the guy with the track record that he, that he had. And honestly, that's one of the gifts that the Lord put in his heart, uh, is to be able to sort out personalities in a good and godly way, let people feel like they're part of the process, that they're involved, that they're wanted, that their words and their music are, is really being appreciated and listened to. But finally, let's make a choice. And so, yes, he was a huge part of making the choice. I think you got the best of six really wonderful uh, people in that band at that time who just really had a desire to make some great music together. And, and it was a result of his stewardship that I think that we were able to walk out the other side of the studio door with an album in our hand that we were all proud of.